I, I guess I, I want you to touch on maybe just the edu- educational aspect that you got from the program. Um, I guess for me, I, um, I, I'm going to come back to, you know, a relationship with food. I shouldn't have a relationship with food. Uh, Food needs to be what I do, what I take in to, um, keep my body running, um, well, and, um, what I can't do with it is when I'm upset use that as the reason why I, you know, eat all these chips and, you know, shove stuff in that really I don't, I mean, and literally while I'm doing it, saying to myself, you're not even hungry. So why are you doing this? And I have found myself, honestly, I found myself doing that um, over the last four weeks that I've been here at my house. Well, it's been four weeks I've been here in my house. And um, so, but even now, like in my mind, I'm, I'm, um, taking in too much, but the things that I'm finding myself gorging on have changed. So I'm not shoving pizza in and buying bags of chips and all of those things. And, you know, I mentioned to you the other day, like I'm eating almonds (laughs) and dried cherries. Like literally those are the things that I'm overeating on. And is it overeating on them? Yeah. Because I'm, I'm, I'm finding myself snacking um, at times that I normally wouldn't eat. Uh, and I come to like that realization all of a sudden in the middle of it, that I'm not even hungry. So why am I eating? Um, mm-hmm. but because it's, I'm, I'm more limited in, you know, being able to associate with people, you know, just being around folks and, and moving in other places outside of my home, that has been a challenge. So, you know, I think my goal for all of this time of isolation that we're all living in is, you know, if I can walk out of my house on the last day, you know, and they tell us that we're free to move about as we'd like to, if I'm on or around the same place that I was when I walked in the door and they told me I had to stay home, then I'm okay. I'm okay. Mm-hmm. With that. Um, because I, I have that recognition that there are those times I've eaten too many of those things. And I know that I'm, I'm going um, up and wait a little bit, but I adjust the next day. And then you know, I, I'm changing what I'm putting in the following days or I walk, you know, like I may have, and that's the other thing that I'm finding the days that I um, eat, like I'm just mindless eating um, are often the days that I didn't walk any place that day. Like it was bad weather outside and I wasn't able to get out and walk the days that I can walk. I usually don't, I, I really don't find myself trying to do any of that snacking thing or looking for something else. Um, because um, I was out like fresh air moving around. And, um, and so I, I don't tend to do it. So, I mean, it's cold out today, you know, and, and I've been looking out, the sun is out there and I've been thinking, gosh, I might need to bundle up and take a walk. Cause I don't want to, mm-hmm. I don't want to, so, I don't want to snack. 